guys, what is up and welcome back to another match preview, round preview video. Uh, we did not do it for round 12 because the AFL fixture was all just all over the place. So we're just going to start fresh at round 13 tonight's match between Gold Coast and Carlton. So make sure to comment down below the head-to-head -head winner, first goal scorer and the margin. There will be a giveaway if someone can get it right. No one's got it right as of yet. Um, but I'm sure it will definitely heat up. So, let's have a look at round 12 before we get into round 13. It seems like ages ago, JWS played Sydney. It was like a week and a bit ago. Uh, Sydney got the better of JWS. Did not see this coming. Uh, they absolutely smashed them. Geelong defeated Power. They just they killed them as well. That was over um, basically at halftime. The Lions beat the Roos by a single point. I mean, it was an up and down game, but that was a really nice win for the Lions. I mean, North have pushed them right to the limit. Uh, the D's uh, beat Collingwood by 10 goals. They were absolutely ridiculous. They're, they're playing some good footy at the minute, Melbourne. And uh, they're coming into some real hot form. Jack Noons kicked the game winner against the Dockers um, on Saturday night after all that controversy during the week. Uh, what a clutch kick that was. And the Bulldogs smashed the Crows uh, on Sunday afternoon. That was a uh, that was a no, no challenge game. I, I genuinely believe the Bulldogs basically won that game at... Um, at halftime as well. The Bombers were a no-show against the Saints. They were too good. And the Crows, uh, sorry, the Eagles beat the Hawks uh, quite convincingly. And then on Monday night, the uh, the Lions, uh, the Tigers beat the Suns in not really the most exciting game of the round. Um, I generally believe, I thought it was going to be a much, much more entertaining game. Uh, but the Tigers, they're uh, seven wins and four losses at the minute. So let's get over to round 13. So like I said, make sure to comment down below. Uh, the goal scorer, first goal scorer, the head-to-head -head winner, and the margin. The winner, if someone can get it right, I'll be doing a giveaway, so make sure to look out for that. Uh, the bull, so I'm, uh, my first goal is going to be Isaac ranking. I'm ranking. I'm going to say that the Suns win. I'm going to say, I'm going to say the Suns win by 22 points. I'll say they'll get the job done. Um, I do like Carlton, but I feel like Gold Coast will win this game. And yeah, so 22 points, Gold Coast Suns ranking for the first goal. Bulldogs and the Demons uh, tomorrow night, uh, tomorrow afternoon. I'm going to say the Dogs will win this game. This will be a really good game. Uh, I feel like it will be really, really tight, but I feel like the Dogs will just be a little bit too good uh, near the end. The Power and the Hawks definitely feel like the Power will bounce back. The Hawks just have so many injuries at the minute, and uh, I definitely don't see the uh, the Hawks able to have enough to beat the Power at Adelaide. They'll get the job done. The Bombers and the Tigers, the Dreamtime Clash. Uh to be fair, I think the Bombers will... I think this is going to be a real ugly clash. I feel like the Tigers will just be way too good for the Bombers. And I feel like they'll... they'll I think they'll, I have a feeling they'll beat the Bombers by over eight goals, nine goals. I'll be surprised if it's less than that. Uh, the Dockers and the Swans. Um, This is actually a hard game to tip. I mean, Fremantle have been playing some pretty good footy. And the Swans have been playing some pretty good footy of late. I'm going to tip the Dockers just can just on the fact that it's in Perth. And I feel like they'll get the job done. Um, they've, been, they've been playing some pretty good footy lately. And I, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm liking their game. Uh, the Crows and the Cats, tipping the Cats to win this one quite easily. I don't really feel like the Crows are going to win the game all year. I feel like they're actually going to go the whole season without winning a game, which is really surprising. Uh, the Lions and the Saints, this is probably going to be the probably best game of the round. Um, no surprise, no, no, I'd say spoilers for game of the round, but I'm going to tip the Lions. I feel like Brisbane will win this game. Uh, even even though St. Kilda are in really good form, I feel like the Lions get the job done. The Eagles and the Giants, I mean, the Giants need to bounce back. If they don't bounce back, then there's a massive chance they could actually miss the finals, which would be, uh, it'd be quite weird considering just how consistent and how good they've been lately and recently in years. Uh, and the final game of the round is the Pies and the Roos. I feel like the Roos uh, are playing some better footy. Collingwood are just playing some awful footy at the minute, but they're definitely going to need to bounce back. That's why I'm tipping the Pies in a close run. So... Make sure to comment down below the head-to-head -head winner and the first goal scorer for tonight's game as we uh, we transition into the match of the round. So my match of the round is the Lions and the Saints. I feel like this will be the best game of the round. Um, just on the fact that both these teams are in the top four, we're going to learn a lot out of these two teams. Um, I'd love to know what you guys think the match of the round is, but make sure to comment down below the head-to-head -head winner for tonight's match, the first goal scorer. But like I said, uh, the Lions actually do have uh, a lot to prove. The Lions actually do have a lot to prove, so I'm going to tip the Lions uh, in a close game. I mean, St. Kilda actually have a lot to prove as well. I mean, Lions have been playing the best footy, uh, but I feel like they're probably, I mean, I mean, they're probably like what best suited at the minute 
uh, to win this game. So make sure, make sure to comment down below the predictions for tonight, um, your tips for this week. I'd love to know what you guys think. We're at the business end of the season. It's definitely heating up. I um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Giveaway if someone gets it correct. And I'll see you guys in the next match preview video.